Blood contains several components, red cells, platelets, and plasma, that can offer different benefits to patients in need. The most common type of donation is a whole blood donation. We insert a needle in your arm and you fill up a bag. That potentially could go up to, th to three different recipients, depending on how we manufacture that blood product. During plasma and platelet donations, donors are hooked up to a machine which separates blood components and returns unused components to the donor. Our plasma line uh, we collect three units at a time, so potentially that could go to three different patients. Plasma is commonly given to people in emergency and trauma situations to help stop bleeding. In a platelet donation, the only cells collected are those that help with clotting. Platelets are commonly given to people with cancer or someone having major surgery. We can collect up to two units at a time per donation, so that could go to two people. Dr. Jeskowicz says donating blood products doesn't just benefit patients in need, it also benefits those who give. This is the opportunity in which they can literally save someone's life. And so this is the one part of medicine in which nearly everyone in the community can be part of someone's medical care. For the Mayo Clinic News Network, I'm Dee Dee Steepen.